present the winner of the Pictorial Quilt 2013. Please welcome Luana Rubin, founder of eQuilter.com and a keen supporter of the event. Luana, please join us on stage. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm so delighted to announce the winner of the Pictorial Quilt category, Stephanie Crawford. So I'm here with the winner of the Pictorial Quilt category, Stephanie Crawford. And Stephanie, I'd just like to talk to you about your beautiful Chinese themed piece. Uh, it really caught my eye. I met you for the first time last night at the awards ceremony, didn't see the quilt. Now I'm here and I'm in awe. Okay. Tell us about, well, the inspiration of this beautiful piece. Uh, well, my son was in China for mm. a year studying Taoism mm. um, at a remote spot in the Hubei province yeah. and uh, I went out to stay with him so we met in Beijing then traveled down together and uh, and then stayed in the mountains so oh. it was th it was really three memorable pieces from that oh. that trip um, uh, it was ex it was ex especially good for me because it was with my son oh. and uh, and it was an amazing place and it was from busy Beijing right down to these this very very remote spot in the mountains oh. um, so three three important memories for me yes so it's a triptych, obviously. Yes. Can you tell us about yes. the three pieces? Um, yes, they're all based on my photographs. Um, I, I did a lot of drawing and painting. Mm -hmm. And then um, it's, they're, they're mainly sort of painted, but uh, some of it is painted and then appliqued on, mm -hmm. and then painted again, and then a lot of stitch, a lot mm -hmm. of stitch. And I'm sure you have people say the ubiquitous question, how long did it take you to make this? <laughs> well, months, actually, probably. That's uh, all? <laughs> <laughs> if you total it up, about three months, I think, really, working full-time, mm. I would say. I mean, I didn't clock the hours, but something like that, mm. yes, from start to finish. Are there any secret messages or little special things you'd like to tell us about in this piece? Um, well, my son features in the, the third one, which represents the, um, uh, the, the, the area where he was in the mountains, in um, the Wudang Temple, the Five Dragon Temple. Mm. And part of Taoism is um, martial arts, and so he is one of the, one of the characters practicing on the terrace there. Oh, that's great. So. <laughs> well, just give us a, a little summary of about your work and what kind of art quilts you like to make. Um, I think my style is, is, is pictorial, definitely. There's no question about that. I'm, I'm a bit obvious, I suppose. <laughs> I, I um, interpret things very, very clearly. I'm not an abstract quilter. I love a lot of uh, free motion quilting, and I love painting. Mm. And it's any combination that's appropriate to the piece. That's great. Well, it's definitely an art quilt. Thank you very much. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us and coming to visit with us here at the Birmingham Quilt Festival. Thank you.